Yeah, I, my my mother likes to tell stories about how I, uh, you know, was an entrepreneur as a, you know, ten, at ten years old and go out and sell my old comics at the curb, you know. And I, I literally started my own business at about fifteen, which was selling these reflective. Uh, nobody knows this. I don't think I've ever told anybody this on camera. At 15, I, I sold these reflective address plates that somebody manufactured, and I had my first employees to help uh, sell and market these reflective uh, uh, plates, and uh, it was good. So that was a little bit of my entrepreneurial spirit early, and I learned, you know, you, you, you wanna make money, you gotta work hard. But to be honest with you, I never thought I would achieve the level of success in terms of wealth. It was always my goal to achieve a sense of satisfaction and influence people to help them increase their businesses. But it was never, you know, that's the target. I want to I want to make a lot of money. You know, it's funny, I, I, I run the world's largest business networking organization, so people think that every opportunity I have, I'm out, you know, at some event. But the truth is, to a large extent, I'm a bit of a homebody. And I, you know, I've always felt that, you know, when you're 70 or 80 years old, you don't, you're not going to look back and say, Gee, I wish I spent more time at the office. My wife and I have a great arrangement. I make the living and she makes the living worthwhile. It was kind of exciting, I think, for my kids the first time they went into a bookstore and there was Dad's book. You know, but then it was like, uh, okay, thanks, Dad, where's Harry Potter? <laughs> you know, when my oldest was about 16, she said, Dad, you're not only not with it, you're not even near it. Thanks, honey, appreciate that. I am living the dream. I, you know, like I said, I'm a 20 year overnight success. It took 20 years to get to this point. But it was really almost 10 years ago where I sat down and I said, okay, I really want to be working more on the business than in the business. I want to be spending more of my time vision making. I want to spend more of my time in strategic planning. I want to spend more of my time being the spokesperson for the company because I get to go do what I love to do, which is this kind of thing. We really are changing the way the world does business. You think about what little is taught in school uh, about selling and marketing. It's really dog eat dog. We're teaching, hey look, let's find ways to cooperate and build each other's business. That, I get turned on by that idea. I mean, that is so exciting. And what's really funny is that I travel around the world, I go to all these countries. And when I say that to them, they go, wow, I hadn't thought about that. You're right, I'm passionate about that. We are changing the way the world does business. And that makes it all worthwhile. And you can stay passionate if you're focused on doing the things you love. I don't know how long before I would get bored doing what I'm doing because I love it so much, how could I get bored?